Hello, my name's Tony, your photo coach from Fab Photos for All. And I just wanted to show you this uh, quick tutorial for Picasso, which is really one of the easiest editing photo software. You can download it here at picasso.com. So you just download Picasso 3.6, get it onto your hard drive, and you're away. Um, I just want to show you now one little editing from... Um, I'm just going to cancel that. Oh, yes, we didn't need that. So, we have a picture here from a friend of ours on uh, Fab Photos for All. And if you look, I reckon the composition, this tulip, which is a beautiful, lovely yellow tulip, is a little bit in the middle. So what we're going to do is go to the Crop tool, which is on your first tab. You have three tabs, Basic, Fixes, Tuning, and Effects. And so start with this cropping tool on the top left and you have different options there you can see that we can crop right down to that um, or even like that and you can spread this if you hold on to the edge and screen out so I'm going to show you how easy this is um, stretching and I, what I want to do is to move the tulip a little bit to the left, get it off center. You see this preview here? So this gives you a preview. And getting there, personally, I'd like to take it in a little bit more. So let's try at that stage. You can also see um, this preview. So let's, let's apply that. And there you have the finished tulip slightly more off-center which you can then save as under the file tab or you can export uh, at a particular size so this Picasa is a wonderful um, tool editing software you can straighten if you have some problem with uh, your horizon you can straighten it out um, give it a little that that's an interesting uh, addition there pushing it even closer in um, you can try all these kinds of editing possibilities. I'm feeling lucky. Well, probably that's changed the color considerably. I'm not over keen on that, so we can undo that immediately. You can auto contrast. Um, okay. And auto color. That's taken off some of the brightness. Auto color. Fill color brightens up the. Um, image considerably. You have to do these filtering edits with care. I wouldn't exaggerate with these tuning things. In the middle of these three tabs you have tuning. Again you have the fill light. You can add highlights um, brightening up the image. This shadows is very useful if you want to uh, add a little contrast. As you can see, the contrast considerably increased there. The outline of the tulip is, is um, much sharper. And this color temperature is an important one. Um, if you see that it's a bit pale, uh, you can add some warmth to it uh, and increase the color temperature. Or if it's a little exaggerated, you can bring it down into a more bluey kind of color this end of the scale. I would keep it uh, for this particular beautiful yellow tulip in the middle there. And the final um, tabs here effects, you can sharpen it. That's useful. Can you see the focus coming in clearer there? Uh, that looks a good amount. Um, you can add film, film grain, saturation adds to the color. Um, I would go around experimenting. This soft focus is a very nice one that you can use to add uh, um, a, a, a depth of field to it. That's a nice one that you can add. And as I say, experiment with these different software editing possibilities. Uh, this Picasso is a wonderful program and I hope you'll enjoy it. So that's Tony Fab Photos for All Photo Coach signing out for now. Cheerio. Look forward to the next one.